Welcome to the Miro TV. We offer you news, local, national, and international. On politics, religious, and social cultural events, project to work documentary, live documentary. Contact us today and do not forget to subscribe and drop your comments as we give you updates on daily basis. Agriculture, a bedrock for living and for human growth. In line with this, Ebon State Agricultural Land Development Authority Board have embarked on sensitization program across the local governments of Ebon State, where government acquired lands are located. Speaking on the importance of mechanized agriculture and building a working relationship among the host communities, the board member led by the chairman of the board, Honorable Mrs. Elekwachiakba, love it. Speaking in Iko local government headquarters and the Undeg and Meg, the host community, respectively, the council chairman, Honorable Sunday Wankwo, first received the board members in the council headquarters in his office. Honorable Lovett, Elekwa Chakma, said they come to seek for the cooperation of the council and to help identify government acquired land in the local government, more so to have a good working relationship with the board. It's to seek your cooperation because without you cooperating with us, I don't think we can make it. We have a lot of things to so that's why we are here. We are here so that you can help us search out those acquired government plans. Because we know that here we have a lot of agreement and existing laws. So we are here so that you can help us to identify them. And also to have a very good working relationship with you. And again, to help us with uh, in terms of security. Because the reason why a lot of people are not doing well is because of this security. But if you can aid us with much security, if us well, we will be someone to help you with you. The Executive Secretary of the Board, Honorable Wale Maswell, emphasized that the rice stands out as far as commercial farming is concerned. And Iqua is taking a lead in the states, and they have come to make it a more realistic in the states. They have come to take a possession of the land that is given to government for our world farming system. And if we talk of young production, Izzy could be beating us, and then we will be following. So the headmaster of Agri, as far as commercial farm is concerned, is rice, and that is where Iko is taking the lead. So my chairman, sir, we are here because there are government lands located at Ndiagamadu in Iko, and then the second one is at Eni Bichiri, Iko, Eni Bichiri and Ike, Iko. So like my chairman said, we are here to take the possession of the place that has been given as a home state to government. Then we are places we reached and some people because government didn't come immediately, started occupying part of the land. We didn't tell them that once you are given a home state to anybody, his any arrival or late arrival does not take it away from him. Because unless you revoke it, and if you should revoke the land, you will follow the normal legal processes. Now we know that the land that was given to government by who has not been revoked. And hence, we have come to take possession of the land. Taking possession of the land does not mean we will carry it away. We will leave it with you and your subject. But we are coming to add value to the land. One, we have the intention of identifying government lands, using those places as demonstration centers, causing all season farm by throwing irrigational mills into that place. And again, when we take the land, we will now measure the land, know what the land is in its entirety, parcelate the land, 
and then allocate majority to your subjects and yourself. The Ikolok government chairman on Sunday Wanko in his reaction assured the board of his cooperation and readiness to form a synergy and to give a maximum support and as well to use a local intel to provide security to the areas why the board do the agricultural activity in the area. I want to assure you of our cooperation. I want to assure you of our readiness to deal with you as you identify more government land. Everywhere you go, including where the land are, we will use a local intel to provide you security to ensure that you do your agricultural land activities safely and clearly. You mentioned the government who speak the traditional ruler to ensure that the enabling environment and other enablers are made available for you to do your work. I'll tell you the truth. We gave you a top notch to Mr. Papa. I'm saying to ensure that everything is in place for you. More so in the host community, His Royal Highness Eze Ezaya Otubo, the traditional ruler in the Amega Autonomous Community in his palace said him and his cabinet welcomed the board wholeheartedly assured them of support and cooperation and to make sure that there is enough food in the states by next year. <laughs> As a Isaiah Otubo prayed for the boy state governor, right on the first of and for the board for a success in the office. The Ndegangmego Autonomous Community, last year to Gali Fu, Ndugulugu, Eklubao, Ehuvo. His Royal Highness, Eze Ezaya Otubo, in turn urged a boy state governor, right on the fancy Obonawifu, to come to their aid by consulting an access road to the community. There is food, much food here, surplus food here, but there is no route to evacuate it. Maro, state for governor, His Excellency, to help us do the road from where the road stopped so that the production of food and evacuation of <coughs> agri produce here will be easy for the farmers as the progress of a bony state shall also continue. Furthermore, one of the cabinet members, Chief Titus Onkosh, emphasized that they have a lot of mineral resources in the community, sharp sand, fertile land, and abundance of agricultural produce are made in the area, but there is no access road to evacuate the products to the consumers. Tarimeka is the land of Ejano Lenyemeka. Government made their own revenue there. State made revenue there. Local government made revenue in that river. That river, I mean, evacuation of this river sand. Sharp sand. Sharp sand. The best. But we need access road. I cannot take by Jericho throughout the season. But there's no road. Some members of the board during the visit include Professor Simon Mwibo, Chairman Committee on Land Parceling and Allocation, Honorable John Wonewo, Mr. Christopher Wonga, and Honorable Agonwa Ejale, among others. What do you think? Drop your comment at the comment section and don't forget to subscribe to this channel, The Mirror TV, as we continue to give you updates on daily basis.